What's going on guys? Welcome back to a new video. Today we have an absolutely crazy rip. This is the most expensive box I've ever bought in terms of the you know price I paid for it. Uh, I've ripped National Treasures, I ripped a bunch of other stuff, but in terms of the price I paid, I paid much less at the time. Obviously back in the day, PE used to charge actual SRP, but um, now we're, we're paying resale for everything. So we're trying some immaculate and is it the best idea? Probably not, I don't know. These resale for a little under probably 3K. I think they were um, available via Dutch auction on Panini's site. Started at 4,000, dropped all the way down to, I forgot where it sold out, but the four was 1,000. I think it sold out in the low 2000s. And these are the premium editions. So a little different from the actual hobby and I'll get into that in a bit. So I always ask, of course, this is a product review. I'm going to be you know, talking about the product a bit and I'm also going to uh, talk about some other important information. Then I'm going to rip the box. If you want to skip all that, you're interested in that, feel free to skip ahead a bit. And uh, we will slow roll too, so feel free to you know uh, go at your own pace through the video. Um, that being said, some new breaks are live on the site, pacmansportscards.com, link in the description, and probably pinned comment too. We have uh, two and three box breaks of this. I might post some more if those sell out. And they can break tonight if they sell out. If um, they don't sell out tonight, then we'll break tomorrow. But a lot of good stuff. Immaculate is one of the highest end products and definitely an exciting one. I'd say National Treasures, Flawless, and Immaculate, and like Opulence are the top ones. And um, let's move these top loaders. Thank you for your service. Move those out of the way. It's an exciting one. Here's the box. Comes in a tin like this. And here's the back. All the stuff you can find. The RPAs are definitely what you're looking for. But there's also a lot of good vet stuff. And 140 card set. Everything's numbered. Only six cards per box or per, per tin, I guess I'd call it. And a little one box inside there. So uh, first off line premium comes with a... A kind of a sneaker swatch like rpa it's um i don't really know what to call it but it's a uh, pretty much a rpa featuring a piece of a shoe uh, from the rookies only 27 signers compared to i believe roughly 39 to 40 for the actual rpa set and so that's actually a plus uh, only big name i know this was missing i think i didn't see kobe white i might have just glanced over too quickly um, but the odds i would say are a little higher to get some of those top guys and then also, there's a, a veteran patch auto number to 20 or less. And there's also one of one versions of these uh, shoe ones. So we'll get more into that in the break. Got the Luca purple and the John next day auto. Trying to maybe maybe if we put some heat in the back, the big heat in here will be more inclined to to show up with its friends. But it's been cut. We're doing some crazy stuff now. Absolutely crazy stuff. I would probably say this is by far by Roughly about, I don't know, I don't know, but at least several hundred more expensive than the most expensive box I'd opened prior to this. So I'm kind of really, really nervous and I may not show it or maybe I do show it, but yeah, I'm, I'm definitely uh, sweating bullets right now. So here's the little sleeve, first off the line premium sticker and you get three autos, two mem cards. So obviously with our first off the line exclusives, we already have two autos, one other auto addition to that. I'm not sure if you can actually get the other RPA set. I would assume you probably can if you're really lucky. And then two medals and a base card. And don't mind the really reflective stuff with these tins. It's, it's really shiny, so I apologize if there's a, a glare at some point. But here's the box we get. Six cards, all thick stock. I'd say roughly 130 and higher point. We'll take this tin, put it off the screen. All right, we'll actually put this guy right here. Let's keep him in the in the picture for some, for some good luck. So I'll take two filler cards and we will go card by card. I have my little blade somewhere around here and I can't even, oh, here we go. This guy will crack this box open. All right, let's see what we got. Oh man, this is crazy. I wanted to try a regular box too, but I'm not too sure. We'll see how this one goes. And one little disclaimer, whether I get a really good pull or a really bad pull, that does not mean that, you know, that's how the product is. I could get some, a Zion RPA. That does not mean you'll get a Zion RPA or a jaw. I could get a, uh, I don't know, I could get something terrible. I could get the worst possible player. That means, that's not mean you'll get the worst possible player. That means you could get something good too. Actually, let me do it like this. Despite being a righty, I'm sometimes a little better with my left hand when it comes to this stuff. All right, there we go. Cards are here. Empty box. Actually, I suppose we could just go like this if it works. Hold on. I see some really thick cards and that's actually somewhat concerning because I don't think I have thick enough top loaders. I don't think so. We'll have to see. But anyway, we'll move these off the screen. 
and let's get started. Whoops, don't mind my thing going off. Let me mute it. Whoopsies. All right. Well, yeah, we don't need this then. First one is, oh, I thought that was Braun for a sec. And look at that. <sighs> same old, same old, man. All year, I have just stacks of damage cards that need to be sent out. And yeah. All right, next card up. But anyway, actually, this is the Dwight. This is the base. I realized I didn't even show you, and it looks really nice. Very sweet stuff. Also, if you haven't already, we have a giveaway going on for this box here. Actually, I realized I never even talked about it. But um, last day to enter. There you go. Link is in the description and the pinned comment to join. Got subs to this channel. Like if you haven't already. Like this video, and then click the link in the description that brings you to Discord, where you'll guess the top. 14 picks of the draft and right as the draft starts and uh hopefully it's a little more fun than the regular ones but here's a mark aldridge jersey to 99 okay so once again i wouldn't say you know you're not going to get six cards that you know blow your socks off you're going to get probably i would say at least four that are just like oh okay unless you get you get tons of great luck all right wait hold on this is something really Uh, this, I don't know if this is the two cards or one card. Huh. Um, I think it's one card. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah, it is one card. Jeez. It's a huge card. Wow. I thought that was two cards. You know, look. Look at that. They had to use another little piece of uh, cardboard. But Soul of the Game, 2 of 16, Tony Parker. This is game worn. So sold the game, then close game worn slash used material is guaranteed by Panini America. That's pretty sweet. That's uh using a game of shoe. My concern is how do we protect this? This thing is is thick, thick. Like this thing is. I mean, here's my hand. Here's um the little Marcus Aldridge to put into perspective. And this right here is probably 130 point. So I'm not too sure what we're doing with uh with this one, but I gotta get creative in terms of protecting this. But that's a really sweet card. Piece of a shoe. Got the uh. Kind of herringbone traction pattern there from the outsole. All right, let's keep going. That's a pretty sweet card, though. Uh, drop a like for, for Tony if you're a fan of him. All right, so here's our patch auto, a veteran patch auto, and that's actually a good one. I'll take that. So two things I'll say. One, Christoph Porzingis, uh, 7 of 14, one off from jersey number. In terms of the veteran signers for this, for the first off the line, I wasn't too impressed with the list. However, once I looked over it again, I realized in terms of percentage of good names to bad names, it's about on par of what you would usually find like for rookies. So it's actually not a, a bad list. It's like Giannis, Hakeem. I don't remember all of them, but a decent amount of, of good guys on there. And Chris Stops is uh, definitely a good one. These are numbered to 20 or less. We got one to 14. And now I'm concerned that my RPA is going to be a, not a good one. That's definitely my, my number one concern right now. And yeah. I just don't think it'll be a... Actually, you know what? Hold on. This is... I would put this in 180 point, not 130. Yeah, so it could be a little loose, but I would definitely do that. So there we go. I'll put that here. And then now let me get this. I think this should be our RPA. All right. Plus us with the good luck. Oh, redemption. Oh, wrong way. Okay, please be. Oh, okay. Uh, rookie. St oh, so this is our. Yeah, this is our. All right, all right, all right. Here we go. Card five. Hachimura. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, man. Okay, we'll take that. Boom. That's good. I was about to say, I, I was going to talk about it earlier, but the good names to get would be Zion, Ja, RJ, Kobe, who isn't in this set, unfortunately, I don't think. If I'm wrong, then Kobe too. Um, what's it called? Rui, Tyler Hero, and I would say Cam Reddish too. Those would be the top guys to get. Okay. That's 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 nice. I like that. I like that. I'm really happy to see that. And our final card is green. Could it be Tatum? Could it be Godi? Who could it be? Let me... I want to smear the ink, so let me just go like this. Oh, oh, oh! 
And Larry Bird scores club 40 of 49. So now I do want to rip another box of this. <laughs> wow, we hit on all three autos. So literally a few minutes ago, I was saying, we're not going to hit on all three autos. You're look lucky to get one. Hmm. Well, I will uh, graciously take this humble pie while being proved wrong in a good way. Nice. So let's recap what we got. Now, once again, if uh, you haven't already, drop a like, drop a sub for uh, <laughs> we're going crazy on one of these boxes. Definitely helps us out. We... um. We spent a lot of money on these on these boxes, especially this year. It's been very, very expensive to do all these, but I really enjoy doing it for you guys. I truly mean that. And um, let's do a recap. And I would definitely say good box. We have, I'm looking at like four booms here. So let's see. We got, whoops, don't mind that. I'm fumbling over the place. You can tell I'm nervous because I'm like just bumping into everything, fumbling around, not focusing the camera. I'm legit sweating. Um, Dwight Howard, 24 of 49 is our base card. These are the base designs. I would say this base design looks really nice. And there's a ding on that Dwight, unfortunately, right there. But it's a nice card. I'll take it. We have, um, Marcus Aldridge, 39 of 99. Very nice card. Jersey card for the Spurs. All right, let's go with this one. We have a giant card. This is like half an inch thick. This thing is huge. Soul of the game. Outsole of Tony Parker's shoes. I wonder if it's that actual shoe, but... Got that nice uh, rubber, some good old traction. That looks like a good pattern, I would say, if you're playing in that shoe. Don't know what shoe it is, but nice. Really nice. Two of 16. Gorgeous card. Uh, we have Larry Bird, 40 of 49, on-card autograph scores club. Gorgeous. I love Larry Bird because he's a good shooter, and I love shooting. So, And he's a legend. He's a Larry legend. I mean, I really can't not like him. And then the most important one is when we hit on... Rookie Sneaker Swatch Signatures Premium Edition. Um, I think there's also the parallels of to be Prime. So this is just the base one. I would believe it's to 40 um, or maybe less, but I would believe it's to 40. Roy Hachimura, that's good. That's one of the seven or eight guys who I was trying to say earlier um, when I was breaking down the odds um, would be one of the better guys to get. So overall, based on my box, I would say I would say very nice. Um, overall, let's hold these guys here. I would say it's very nice. Oh, and Christoph Porzingis. Sorry, KP. 7 of 14 KP. So, I mean, three highlights right here, plus that Tony Parker. Overall, I would say I was very impressed with this box. And, I mean, these boxes are selling for a little under $3,000. So, insane. We did get four booms, which is awesome. But that doesn't mean you could get the same thing. I would definitely um, maybe, you know, do a little more research if you want to buy one. Or if you want to, you're debating between buying and selling. Definitely do, uh, do your due diligence and say, you know, maybe some boxes could be bad. Some could be amazing. You never really know. You could, I could get Roy. You could get Zion. You could get, I don't know who else is there. Like uh, someone just really bad. Boxes differ. I would say we got a good box. I would like to see some more. We're ripping some hopefully soon on Pac-Man breaks. New group breaks are um, down below in the description and the pinned comment. So if you want to see us rip a ton, you want to get into a group break, go check out my site. Once again, links in the description of this video. And um, we'll hopefully we can break tonight, if not tomorrow, if not the day after. So that's it does it for this stuff. I am chatting a lot because I'm just like, over sensory overload with all these awesome cards i'll have to end on this one because i love the love the shoe ones and yeah good luck if you guys get some if you guys are uh, buying into the group race best of luck i might try one more if you want to see another one smash the like button and i'll think about it we can try one more and uh, definitely drop a sub if you haven't already check out the giveaway here and new group breaks on the site so enough chit chat enough of your time thank you guys for watching kaboom i'm so happy and time to uh just take a long nap because i'm uh physically and mentally exhausted after this one so thanks for watching guys like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys later